So you have to use Google Voice for this to work. Um, you have to either get an invite from Google to sign up for Google Voice, which takes about a few weeks to a month, or get one of your friends to invite you that who already has a Google Voice account. Now usually Google Voice, to use it, you would have to have a mobile phone already and Google Voice will call your phone. But instead of using your a phone number, you go into the settings here, click under phones, and click this box right here. Make sure it's selected so when you use Google Voice, it will phone your Google Chat account and you can call through your Gmail account. And usually there wouldn't be a normal way using, using the regular apps on your iPod Touch to, to do this, but um, there is an app now that has Google Voice and Google Chat all in one nice uh, format that is just really great. And so let's get into that. Alright, in the first part of the video, I forgot to mention that if you live outside of the US, you can still get Google Voice. If you just search Google or YouTube, you will be able to find a way to get it. First thing to do on your iPod Touch now is to download Talkatone, which is free, Infinite SMS, which is $5, but the light version is free, or Messenger for Google Voice. Um, pretty obvious which one does which talk tones calling and an SMS to text if you do not have the fourth generation iPod touch you'll need headphones with a mic to call people and if you have a first generation you'll need a touch mod mic and I'm not sure if they still sell those so I'll quickly demo texting here um, just kind of a regular nice UI. You can go in here, type in a number or add from your contacts. Uh, let's add this one here. Alright, send a message. Hi. Send. Should pop up on this phone in a sec. Pretty nice phone, you know. Alright, there's a message. Hi. Um, I'll just reply to that now. say, I don't want to bother typing on this keypad, so I'm going to send that now, and it should pop up in this convo in about a second. Okay, sending complete on this phone. And there it is, all right. This also has push notifications, which is good. All right, now let's get into the thing we're all here for. And by the way, Infinite SMS and Talktone, they all use your Google Voice number to text and call, and you just sign into your Gmail account on both of those. All right, so Talktone's got keypad, contacts, recents, and your settings. I'll just dial the number here. It says calling. Should come up on this phone in a second. Alright. Talk. And put on speaker. Hello. Alright. I ended that quickly because it just was about to get really, like, I don't know, loud. Um. But it worked as you saw. So now I will call my iPod from this phone. It's connecting. And there it is. And you press accept. And then with Google Voice, you press 1 to answer or 2 to listen in on the call. Or plus, press 1. Hello. 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 All right. And I ended that quickly just because it was really loud. Okay, so that's it. Free calling, free texting, all in one number on your iPod Touch. It's pretty sweet. If you do have multitasking, 
if you, and talk tones running in the background, you'll be able to receive calls no matter what app you're running. Uh, as long as talk tones in the background, you'll receive a little uh, notification. If not, then you'll have to be in the app to receive a call. Well, that's not so bad. So, uh, have a good time calling all your friends and everyone else. Uh, see you later.